Hi everyone, my name is David Vinoker of Captivix. We are a business technology company in Chicago and Microsoft partner, specializing in Microsoft Dynamics ERP implementation. This video is part of our Dynamics AX introductory series and is meant to help you learn the interface of the new AX and complete your business tasks. In this video, I will show you how to create a new raw material product. So let's jump right in. All right, so to get started, click on the main navigation icon and expand product information management, products, and released products. Here you'll get a list of all of your products. In the filter box, enter in the letters, the prefix that distinguishes your raw materials. For, in this case, it's RM. You'll need this list because you'll need to know what to name your new raw material. Once you've seen your list, click on the new button and you will get a pop-up with all the fields for the new product. Go ahead and enter all the information for all the product fields. Here we have item group, we'll choose computers, storage dimension group, we'll choose site warehouse, tracking dimension group, here we'll choose none, and we'll give it a product number. We'll give it the next one in the sequence, so it's RM007. We'll name it DVD ROM, and the search name should populate automatically. Inventory unit, purchase unit. As you can see, you can just start typing. You don't necessarily have to click the drop down icon. And here we'll select an item model group. We'll give it a moving average. Click OK. And the system will enter in your new product and you'll see it in the list. Now you can click on it to review it. You can make any changes you'd like. For example, here we can change the production type to none. Give it a calculation group. click on phantom you'll get more options for example you can expand the manage cost section and go ahead and modify any fields that you would like and remember to hit save in the top left there's also a quick shortcut to all the other products that you have open and that's uh, this icon right here you can just click on the next product that you would like to manage and go ahead and manage it right from there so that's it. It's a pretty simple way to add in a product. And here, in this case, it's a raw material product. Uh, if you enjoy this video, go ahead and subscribe and give us a thumbs up. Enter in your comments if you'd like a little bit more information. Or you can go ahead and contact us at www.captivix.com. Thanks a lot for watching. Take care.